What is up YouTube, Guy and Kicks here with another review and in today's video guys we're going to be talking about the latest New Balance 993 and Amelie Andor collaboration in that brown and green colorway. So without further ado, let's jump into it and let's talk sneakers. Alright guys, so some information about this collaboration. These first released on November 8, 2021, and that one was through a draw. You were able to enter through your Amelie Andor account, but you were only able to pick one colorway per entry. I was able to grab these through the draw. You had about 24 hours to enter, and then I think they announced it either Wednesday or Thursday if you uh, hit on these. And then on November 11, 2021, that's when they had their regular release alongside the apparel, which was very clean, very sharp, but of course, out of my budget, so I didn't really buy anything except this hat, but all the other stuff was very, very clean, but just too damn expensive. So these retail for $200. As I said already, the two colorways, you have this one, the brown and green, AKA the beef and broccoli, and then you also had the taupe and purple colorway. The taupe and purple colorway was more limited, those are now you know, going for a lot more on the resale market. But for me personally, these brown and greens were my favorite colorway of the two. And I'm so happy that I was able to grab them. You know, these weren't as hard to get, I think. I think a lot of people did get these if you put in for them, if you really wanted them. Of course, some people, you know, took L's and that's always unfortunate. You know, they're not gonna have a sneaker for everybody, but I think for most people, they wanted these, they were able to get them. You know, the taupe and purple, you know, definitely a different story there for sure. So getting into the colorway here a little bit, pretty basic, three main colors. You know, you have the brown color on most of the upper layers of the suede, and then you have the green color on the new buck part of the upper of the shoe. And then the midsole and the outsole is basically all black. These also come with three pairs of laces. I have the green and brown ones on here. I think these are my favorite. And then you have the all black and then the all brown laces. In terms of the material, the upper primarily has that pig skin suede on the upper layers of the shoe and then you have some perforated suede around the toe box the heel collar as well some nubuck on the front of the tongue and then also on the heel part of the shoe the underlays on these 993s is that mesh material very breathable and it's in that brown color as well the insoles have the Amelie leon door brand on the back here and they're stitched in in that yellow color on the front of the tongue you have the new balance made in usa embroidered underneath that you have a cutout of the 993 model and then you can see the us flag there on the back the top eyelids on these 993s is in this plastic material and then you have the end logo there as well. As you come down to the toe box area, like I said already, that's where you're gonna see most of the mesh. You have a little bit of a strip of 3M there across the toe box. On the side of the toe box, you have some perforated new buck suede in that green color. On the lateral and medial side, you have the end logos, and of course, they are reflected. On the heel part of the shoe, on the heel counter, on the lateral side, you'll find the 993 number. On the middle part of this heel counter, you'll find a cutout where you'll find the Ahmed Leon Dor brand, and that material there feels like it's some kind of nylon material. On top of that, on the heel collar, you'll find some additional 3M reflective material. Underneath the heel counter, you'll find that classic heel stabilizer, which is translucent. You have the New Balance name in black, and then underneath that is also in that green color. The midsole on this 993 is all black, and the cushioning system that they use here is the Absorb DTS. And the outsole part of the shoe is made out of rubber, all black outsole, you have the New Balance name in the middle, and then these also have Endurance as well. In terms of sizing, these are made in USA, so for me, I mostly go a half size down. Most of my sneakers, I get them a size 10, but for my made in USA's, I usually go a half size down. So for these, I went with a nine and a half. I do have another pair of 993s. Those are a size 10 because that's the only size they have for that colorway and these in a nine and a half definitely feel a lot better. They feel more of a perfect fit. In terms of comfort, the 993 is a really comfortable shoe, guys. If you never own a pair of 993s, I definitely recommend you do. You're still gonna get all day comfort, similar to a lot of the popular models. So don't sleep on the 993 when it comes to comfort. You know, the Absorb DTS definitely has a nice balance between firmness and softness doesn't feel too soft or too bouncy. Very nice feel, highly recommend the comfort on the 993. And the shoes come in this nice custom Amelie Endure box. 
very cool color i love this like army green color and then you have the branding in like a gold color as well and here you have the official tag in sku all right guys so my final take on this new balance 993 and amelie and door collaboration for me personally i think that this was a cool collaboration definitely a needed boost for the 993 model i think this is going to catch a lot of people's eyes because of course anytime ald touches a new balance there's going to be hype people are going to go after those so i think the 993 definitely needed a boost and for this collaboration they definitely delivered like i said already in my opinion this beef and broccoli colorway is my favorite one i love it because it kind of reminds me you know i was in the military i was in the navy so you know it has some military vibes here in terms of the colorway you know it reminds me of a camo uniform so for me i kind of have a little bit more of a connection because of that but overall you know i like brown colors don't love them though but depending on the brown i will go for those but then you slap on this green color it just like a perfect colorway for me. I don't really have anything that looks like this. So when I saw this colorway, I was like, nah, that's the one that I want. You know, the taupe purple is still clean, but just something about that color combination just didn't go well for me. So I'm glad I was able to get these, but because the taupe and purple were more limited, people took more L's on those. Obviously on the resale market, they're going for more money. But these right now on the resale market, they're going close to retail. So probably try to go get them now because they are an Amelie and Door collaboration and it will very likely go up in price over time. So if you really like these, if you really wanna go after them, then get them now before it gets too expensive. What's very cool about this collaboration, like I said, is that it does give the 993 a boost. You know, I've said this before in my previous 993 review, I'll leave a link here so you guys can check that out, is that the 993 is a sleeper. You know, it does look a little bit similar to the 992, but not quite. I feel like one of the things that I can knock the 993 for is that the midsole, looks a little bit cheaper compared to like a 992 for example or some of the other 99x sneakers i think the midsole here is probably as weak as in terms of how it looks and how it feels not that it's weak in terms of comfort i think in terms of comfort it still delivers but i think there's some parts of the shoe that kind of makes it look just a little bit cheaper than comparing it to like a 992 which is a more popular silhouette but in terms of the materials on the upper the suede here everything feels super premium my only knock would be the new buck that they use here feels a little bit rough kind of feels like a little bit like very light sandpaper so i wish it was a little bit softer and smoother but other than that the suede overall feels very premium and very nice so with all that being said let me lace these up and show you how they look on feet Alright guys, so that's it for me. Hopefully this video brought you a detailed look of the New Balance 993 and Amelie Andor in this brown and green colorway, aka Beef Broccoli. Let me know in the comments below you were able to grab one of these. Do you like this colorway more or do you like the taupe purple more? And like always guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you to all the new subscribers. Thank you for helping me keep growing this channel. I can't do that without you, so I appreciate it. Much love. You can also follow me on Instagram at Guy and Kicks. I'll leave a link to my page below so you guys can go follow me there as well. And that's it, guys. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.